Hello everyone, in this video we are taking a look at a new vehicle, Trek Mool. Six wheels, skid steering, so she can turn on the spot. In the rear is room for a container, maybe one SCU, I am not sure at the moment. And at the front there is some kind of forklift. Let's go inside. <laughs> yeah, those animations are really bad. He just teleports and then he goes inside. Okay, let's start her up. Now we are inside. She is really, really small. We can deploy those forklifts. Right now they are doing nothing. Deploy. I don't think you can move anything yet. And retract. For comparison, now she is next to a cyclone. Yeah, not as wide as a cyclone, almost same height. Not as long. Quite cute, actually. Yeah, she can turn on the spot. Doesn't always work. I guess work in progress. Not good for your tires, but we have this in real life with a few vehicles. So very helpful in tight quarters. Interesting sound when she tries. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Driving physics are still non-existent, but CHG will work on driving physics. I guess she will be very useful. <laughs> those physics. I guess she will be very useful to load ships like for example a caterpillar. Yeah, but not very useful to load a Titan and I am very skeptical about loading a freelancer with this mule. But I guess she will find a role. Yeah, it look physics. Just the front wheels are touching the ground. <laughs> I cannot wait for driving physics and I will take a very close look how good or how bad those driving physics are but it cannot be anything worse that's for sure in case you are wondering no we don't have any shields we have two power plants we have drivetrain which is your default drivetrain in any vehicle it always has zero health and we have one cooler no shields and yeah obviously no guns just a short video i hope you found it interesting <laughs> and see you next time bye auf wiedersehen Hey, you are still here. You might want to join me on Twitter. My Twitter account is Camoral underscore SC.